What is up guys, this is Desolide, and today I am reviewing Baby Driver. Whoops. <laughs> so, I'm going to be completely honest with you. When I saw the trailer last year-ish, and I saw the title and the name, I wasn't excited. <laughs> I had low expectations. I did not want to see this movie. But when I saw the poster, and I'm talking about the pink one, and I'm talking about the pink one with the gun, um, that says all you need is a killer track. And I saw the reviews that came out for this, I was pumped. And I am so happy to say, I like this movie. This movie is so amazing. It's upbeat and it keeps you on your feet. On the edge of but your you're seat. Down. <laughs> it keeps you on the edge of your seat. And <sighs> what can I say? There are so many things I could say about this that are kind of spoilery, but um, I guess a few things that I could say they're not really spoil spoilery is one of the biggest aspects I like is you constantly listen to music throughout the whole movie. Like Every time that a baby, the main character, has headphones in, you're listening to what he's listening. And honestly, that kind of makes a connection with the character that is pretty great, especially at the very end that I won't get into. That is just how they utilize sound it is so great to hear that. Uh, this movie try, does its best to look visually and um, give you a story visually, but also makes the audience hear. Like, listening is very important to this movie. I did hear a little criticism from when I, a Chris Stuckman review about the dating of Deborah, and I do have to agree with a few of my friends that it was a little rushed, but there's a very middle sequence that the mood and the tone changes from what is, is what is established in the very beginning. And that same tone is like kind of repeated at the very end. And then there's this little mint mid tone that is off. And at first I didn't like it, but when that tone was met with the tone established in the very beginning and the very end of the movie, I understood it. And it is so great, especially introducing the Deborah character. And all of the romance is rushed. It felt real. It wasn't like Star Wars Episode Two Anakin Padme romance that is just like, <laughs> it, it actually felt real. You actually feel what baby is feeling. You really think that these two characters are in love. You really get a sense of they belong together. And that romance and baby's goals are really, really nice to see. So I I have to give these I have to give this movie a really high rating. Entertaining aspect A plus and the artistic level as well, <laughs> A plus as well, because Holy crap, go watch this movie. I was blown away. My expectations went down here, and at the end of the movie, it went here. And there was not much wrong with it either. I mean, there was actually a quote that I thought was wrong with it, but after talking to Samus Ray about it, I realized that that quote was actually needed. Like, I could not find many flaws in this movie. And I just saw it too, so it was very fresh on my mind. So th that is it, ladies and gents. Um, I want to thank you again for, for watching and for, and as well, always, you were the audience. I was a desert lad and thanks for watching. And enjoy the show. I'm gonna see Baby Driver with some of these idiots. Hey, Aaron, you wanna be a YouTube star? I'm already a YouTube star. Damn right.